Hello and welcome. Hello and welcome to another uh, tutorial on uh, Ableton Live. Um, this lesson we're going to be talking about <coughs> drum processing um, and uh, how to get a really nice punchy sound. Now, as we all know, Ableton, you're only able to do. Um, uh, you're only able to have so many different uh, returns. I think it's up to J. Um, so, you know, it's quite limited, limiting in that aspect. But uh, my little setup here that I've got uh, with my kicks, snares, and claps, and hats, um, I'm able to create as many different sort of uh, sends and returns as, as I want. Now, here, I've got my kicks, so I've got three kicks here. I've got an 808 kick, I've got a sub kick from, uh, let me just figure out which sample pack I've got that from. Um, I got it from the Dark Side Glitch Step Science to Sample uh, library pack. It's great, great for, you know, glitch step and stuff like that. Um, and then my third kick is a mid kick, which I've taken from the uh, Rankin Audio 2, Ultimate Dubstep 2, which is really nice, really nice, you know, punchy kick. Um, so, now with these kicks here, I've then created a, a second group called Kick Processing. And within this group, I have for compressors, all different types of compressors. You got the SS, the Solid State Logic compressor, the SSL, Vertigo, and then the API. Now, I mean, you don't have to have you know like these third-party plugins. You know, you can always just use you know, the the compressors found within Ableton. It's it's up to you really. Um, <clears throat> but I've got them in. Uh, order which I think works, you know, you, you, you can create whatever order you want them to be in, but, you know, this order for me works <clears throat> for the drums that I'm trying to, the, the kick sound that I'm trying to get. Now, um, to get this all routed, uh, you've got these three kicks here, um, they're all being routed to the group. Now to do that, you click to you click on each of these tabs, and you select group for each one, and that sound will then go into here, into this group channel. Now, afterwards, you're going to have to take the audio two here and send it to the first um, monitored channel here, which is the SSL. Afterwards, you send the audio two here to the CLA seventy six, and then the Vertigo, and then the CLA seventy six to the Vertigo, and then the Vertigo to the API, and then the API then to the group here. Okay. So essentially, you know, with having things monitored in, you can then adjust the volume of processing um, that your kick is going to be doing, right? So this is what my kick sounds like soloed. Okay, so it sounds really, really punchy, and that's because of the amount of compression that's done within each one. Now, I'm not going to go into details about the settings for the compressors because this is a, a video on the routing. Now, the same is done for the snare, and the same is done for the the hats. You know, the same kind of processing, and the same sorry, the same routing. Um, and then finally, what I've then done is that I've taken to, taken each of the process in here, each of the processes, and sent it into a bus, into a drum bus. Now here I've got a multiband compressor and the API 2500 set to uh, a mastering preset. And here I've 
you know, adjusted the volume of that outgoing sound. Um, so yeah, I mean, it's just a, it's just a you know quick tutorial on the writing that I found is the best for me. Um, you can do the same sort of writing for your basses and your different ambient effects and whatnot, you know, and it doesn't just have to be compressors, you know, you can put different EQs, you can have different um, effects, you name it, you know, you can just drop them into, into these audio channels and make them into a monitor. So you essentially got, you know, unlimited really amounts of uh, returns. So yeah, just a great little tip for you guys to mess around with and uh, hopefully use and uh, enjoy. Okay, well, thanks a lot for watching and uh, I shall be releasing this track that I'm working on now very shortly, actually. I think it's quite close to being finished, but I'll let you all know. Alright, take care guys. Bye.